Lass doch gut hier hüpfen. afternoon and evening right now it is about three o'clock on the uh, 30 no wait 47th vlog actually and it is a nice day it's sunny it is not cold it is blue skies it is it is nice and warm it is nice and warm yes. but we have one problem what? yesterday I built a kite and to be honest if you look at the trees you just see them like move very slowly oh. And that's sad because this morning Ilona was like, hey, you found any rope? I'm like, no, I didn't find any rope yet. And then all of a sudden we see the box of the cat with his toys and everything. Yeah, this is a scratching pole. Of course, we cannot use that kind of rope, but that box had like all kinds of stuff that the cat used to play with, like plastic bags and kalamakia and cables so he doesn't bite ours. And there was also a scratching pole. This one was when he was little. Uh, maybe I can find a video and insert it here and there were all these pieces of this kind of rope connected to it So meanwhile, I have been cutting there was also another piece uh, kind of rope attached to it It was this kind of stuff and yeah, well I attached it to it. I was hoping to actually go Kite flying right now. Can you hold it for a second Ilona so we can see how big it is? So I'm just gonna take the rope, we'll go somewhere, we'll get some gas first because we did not get gas last time. It is a symbol that uh, you fly high to the air, so it is symbolize your soul. It's like uh, it is trying to go high. That's and funny. do we believe in that? Oh, but it's funny. I just want to fly a kite to be honest and I want to be a little bit like with the Greeks by flying it, but I'm so non-Greek by creating my own kite from trash bags and everything from garbage bags. I did it with my grandma, with my grandpa. You did it with your grandpa yeah, as well, we did yeah. A huge one. We got five garbage bags. Black. If huge this ones. works, we're gonna beat next year's record mm. and we'll just build like a huge one, you know? Like we'll get some real wood or some real sticks, some big ass plastic and just well, try to really fly it. Do you mind doing that? being used as a this car is being used as a cat staircase sometimes and it's very funny because we can see exactly where and how they just passed on this car it's barely to see I don't know if you can see it on camera but there's like these these little stripes here and especially on the hood you can see that one slid away probably because it was very slippery <laughs> walk right now and we're checking out the weather but to be honest it's really not that great for like kite flying 
it is way too good, it's way too pretty as well. Yeah, so a lot of people with kites, but it does not really work out. It is actually that good of a weather that right there they're playing, they're playing raquetes in their swimming wear. What do you say? You want to stay here and try to fly the kite or go to Gorica and try to fly the kite there? Um, yeah, I don't know. Hmm. I like it here. It's nice up there as well. I don't know. I want to fly my kite and enjoy the sun both, so we'll go up. say I'm like almost on top of the world somehow. It is gorgeous around here. Uh, I don't know exactly how high this is. I'll look it up later. But uh, it was a little bit too far for Ilona to walk. But the view as always is amazing here. And maybe in the background you hear a little bit of like noise that's from the factory. Because right there they make like cement and uh, concrete as far as I know. That's why they blow up half the mountain. But it's not that annoying if you're on the other side of the of Horitza. I just met a fellow YouTuber actually. That was kind of fun. I didn't introduce him to the vlog, but I will probably later if I see him another time. Uh, his name is Pada Jutis Rafael. I'll put the link up in here. And he makes uh, fitness videos and all kinds of stuff like that. I upload daily. He uploads like five times a week. He tries to at least, as far as I know. This This view is amazing, really. This view is amazing. You can see the entire city here. How are you doing? Fine. You're enjoying the sun? Nice. So, as you also might have noticed, it is not the weather to fly a kite. Not the weather to fly a kite. Not the weather to fly a kite. Not, 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 not.
That is so nice. Babe. I'm so proud. Yeah, after a lot of garbage bags and a huge amount of duct tape. Not duct tape, what was that? Paint, yeah, <laughs> painter's paint. But it is flying. Can you make it fly there? No. Why not? It's pretty. It's not where the wind goes. Well, I don't care. <laughs> make it go there. <laughs> it's beautiful. It is nice. You will not believe how proud I am right now to make something out of garbage bags and stuff we found here to make it more heavy on the tail, but... And this view next... Okay, it is not cold. Ilona is chilling. I'm fine. Ilona's... It's nice. Yeah, it's nice. But the view that we have with this kite right now, it is unbelievable. I mean, Ilona showed it already enough, I think, but that's amazing. And then having that thing in the air, that's so cool. And just like that we were back home. Uh, we left the mountain there but sadly enough without any memory on my phone right here so couldn't record anything more but we had an amazing time and not short sure after the last clip actually also we left. Uh, Ilona though has been cooking, has been slaving pretty much but we've got food like a real cazara de ftera. Yeah. yeah most of them. For two people definitely. Only one thing I don't know what it is. The red one. Yeah. Um, What's that? Pazzaro salata. Pazzaro salata? Yeah. Ah, red beet. Yeah. With garlic and yogurt. Of course, garlic. And now we've got more garlic and that's the scorralia. And I have to say, the one that Ilona makes, it really burns your tongue. Mm -hmm. It's really cool. If you eat it with bake rolls, you, the bake rolls make like little cuts in your face, in your tongue sometimes. Face. And it like, it tingles your tongue. So tasty. We've got some nice eggs and with, with some... A lot of pepper and oregano. And okay. Kolikithaki, fried, no, that's not, zucchini is something else. I don't know. It's a, yeah. it's a family of zucchini. Gigantes. In tomato sauce. Yep. Gigantes in tomato sauce. Or also known as big white beans in tomato sauce. The most important thing. The right? most important thing, taram salata. Lagana. And lagana, the bread that we told you about. Anyway, we are going to eat right now and we like to thank you for watching this video. If you're not subscribed yet, please subscribe down below. If Leave a comment, we love to read them anyway. We, as long as we always can right now, we will answer to it also. So please leave a like and we'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.